I mean, I'm not even going to apologize here because it's just pathetic. And I will show you how to use Chroma Keyer into its fullest potential. I mean, this is more like a basic tutorial because uh, I would like to. I'm planning on making another one in which, in which I'm going to show you how to actually use Chroma Keyer more in more creative ways. So uh, let's just take this clip because you can see that we have our douchebag just nicely in front of the blue background, and nothing else is kind of distracting here. And what I'm planning to do is that I will just leave this um blue or and then change the color and this character i want him to be black and white i mean he's kind of colorless anyway so what i'm going to do here is use chroma here and i will go just for the blue screen but you need to first you need to uncheck this box so because you can see the color changes it tries to apply some kind of um color itself but uh, the the background doesn't have this one so in order to uh, catch the color properly you need to you need to uncheck it and then uh, go for this tool in order to pick it yourself you can see that here it's more um, the blue is more light here it's more dark so let's just go for the middle somehow and then check it now nothing happened because we have two same clips in the same sequence and one has uh, chroma here applied but you can see the magic when you go for black and white apply for the and apply it to the clip you used chroma here for so you can see he's already kind of black and white but it's not it's not really perfect you need to play around with the settings here and what you do is that this will get you um, this will get rid of the um the color in this case the blue color you are trying to eradicate and this one focuses on the other colors in our case when i apply the black and white it gets it makes it more i don't i'm not sure you can see it here properly but when i go like this He's uh, actually really black and white and he doesn't have this kind of pale um, orange-like color. So this might be actually um, this might be actually kind of perfect. Everything we need here is black and white and we have blue background. But what you can do here is uh, this is the way why why uh, my chroma key is for me it's better than doing using other tools. You can go for other effects in order to kind of make it more interesting. So let's go for black and white and let's apply the color balance and put the red there. As you can see, it kind of fucked up again. Let's put this one there. It looks really nicely. Uh, and what we need to do here is fix uh, the chroma key here again. As you can see, the way I did it was again I was playing around with the I was playing around with these two uh, with these two settings. Now it doesn't really uh, it doesn't have the it doesn't have the red lines over the character. You can you can't always do that. It's uh, it really depends on how well the the clip is structured here. If you have a very distinguished color in the background which is not in on the character but uh, it, you do, you can't always do that but this is a nice way if you actually have something like this here what you can also do let's just go for less creepy color here uh no what do i wanted to do i wanted right let's go for them okay uh, and I want to insert another video track and I want to use um, one of the animations from Rbeats uh, Film Clutter. Uh, this one is very commonly used. I will provide more information in the description in, in order if you, in, if you want it and if you actually um, been searching for it. So you can see that I just applied it here and um, we can get rid of the black by setting it to dodge. Because I use chroma here for, for this effect, for this Sin City effect, um, it allows me to play around with the background. You uh, don't stop with the, with the effect like black and white, it looks kind of uh, boring. So let's apply some, let's apply some um, more brightness and contrast on it, on it. And this way you will have, uh, you will see the the borderline a bit better. I'm going to focus on uh, chroma care 
a bit more in another tutorial in which I will show you a bit of the of the of the effects which are commonly used uh, in the AME uh, community. So thank you for your attention.